Hey everyone, let me show you a handy new tool in Odd One Photo Raw 2018. And that's the ability to create a color range mask. I'm going to use it in this case because I want to add extra sharpening to just these foreground flowers and I really want to target just that blue to lavender color range to do it. But there's also some of that color in the sky. So watch how I do this. I'm going to use a dynamic contrast filter. I'm going to use a high amount of small and I'm going to use no medium or large. Now this is applying to the entire photo. To limit it just those colors, I'll open up the advanced masking section. I'll turn on the color range option. I'll grab the little eyedropper tool and I'm just going to sample one of those colors out of the flowers. Now if we turn on the view mask option, we can actually see where that dynamic contrast is being applied. Right now it's being applied 100% to that color and then it gradually applies to the other surrounding colors. We can use the color range slider right here to narrow that down to really just the color that we want. So I'm going to narrow it down so it's hitting just those flowers in the foreground. Now because there's some of those extra colors above, we need to get rid of those. I could paint those out or I'm just going to use a masking bug. We'll add a gradient mask on top of it. I'm going to pull it down and twist it and make it a little bit smaller. There we go. Now let's turn our view of the mask off. We'll go back to our photo and watch. There's before and after. Let me turn it up really high so those guys jump out. There. Now we've made those little flowers in the foreground jump out without affecting anything else in the scene without having to go through and manually paint those guys in. Just like that. The color range mask option works hand in hand with all of the other masking options in the advanced masking section and with all the masking tools. It's just one more way that you can selectively apply your effects and filters just the way you want.